Happy Easter, everyone! It's your girl, Team B. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone at work. <laughs> now, this is awkward when I make these videos, but it's okay. Let me pause my news. Um, it's 8 o'clock in the morning. I'm having my coffee. Uh, I took the day off today, and I want to spend time with family. I miss my son. Um, yeah, so... I think I'm going to do something a little different than I've done every year. Every year that I've, I, well, every Easter, this is my first Easter at my new place. So every Easter prior, I would work and I never really had the mornings. Do you hear the babies outside? This is why I love Easter. I love spring. You hear the birds, you hear the babies hatching, and it's just so cute. Like, there's just babies, you know, going, like, through a world right now where everyone's worried and, like, people are dying and sick and just negative and people think that they can't have Easter and have fun with their family because of the coronavirus. I know you can't have a big party like, you know, you probably normally do, but we can still cook. We can still spend time with our families. I mean, we hell, we're in the house with them. I mean, we're around them still. We could still make the most of it. And Easter's just about Easter baskets and, you know, spending time with the kids and stuff, you know. So, uh, I don't see why not. I mean, really, I don't know what's wrong with that. Whatever. Uh, anyway, so I'm going to go to my grandma's house today, and we're going to cook. I'm assuming she's cooking now this damn early in the morning. Um, but I thought I would do something different this year. So I don't get people Easter. Like, I get my son Easter basket, um, but that's about it. But I took today off. So I think I'm going to run to Walmart real fast and I'm going to write out here in my notes. <clears throat> I think I want to do like Easter baskets for um, like my son, but like I want to do it for like my mom, my grandma and my brother. Not like candy and shit, because Lord knows my brother does not need to be eating no candy. But, um, so I was gonna write down here in my notes of like what I wanted to get them. So then I was gonna run to Walmart and like go pick it up and like make like this cute little shit, you know what I mean? Because, I don't know. That's just how I feel right now. That's how I feel. But, um, yeah. Other than that, I hope you guys are doing fantastic. I hope you guys are doing something today. I hope it's just not the same old shit, you know? Because today's supposed to be, like, a rebirth of just life. Like, happy birthday to our God. And happy birthday to, uh, whosever birthday it is. <laughs> Oh, Lord. I was, as soon as I turned on the news, hold on, I'm sorry, this is so rude. Okay. As soon as I turned on the news this morning, um, you know, of course there's like church or whatever, and this guy was talking about how, this preacher was talking about how he was doing cocaine and shit, and 1980, and now he's like, whatever, it was just getting annoying. And I'm like, and then I go to look in the back of him because I heard him say San Diego. And then I look in the back of him, I'm like, oh, hell no. That's the church down the street. <laughs> that's the damn preacher from down the street. How the hell did he get on the news? Huh. He looks funny. This guy looks funny, don't he? He looks so f he looks so goofy. I gotta stop this. Come on, we're talking we're p positive energy here, Brittany. Come on, that's so rude. 
That is so rude, calling people funny. I want to watch the news, but... <sighs> Anyways, but, um... Oh, my Lord. You know, me not having my eyebrows done is, like, really, really getting to me. Look at this. Look at this shit. Look. The fuck is this? Oh, my God. I feel like I'm breaking out. But I'm not. They're just like red spots. And like it's not a bump or anything. Like I don't understand. But look at my eye, bro. Look at my eye. Whatever. Anyways, you guys. Comment down below what you've been doing during this whole quarantine. And tell me what you guys are doing today. What is going on? You ever feel like you wake up and like your, your face is swollen? Whatever. I'm not deleting this neither. Normally I would delete it and start over, but I'm not doing it. Watch, I don't even download this shit. That's sweet. On the news, the, um, what is this? The football season. Okay, so the coach was running around to all the, like, high schoolers that do football. I'm putting, like, 2019 rings on there. That's sweet. That's really, really sweet. I know I am so fucking boring, and we're going on seven eight minutes um you know you know what's really crazy is i know today and please today i don't want to sound stupid or ignorant but t is today like what is what does Easter represent? Like, I know it has something to do with God. But if Christmas is his birthday, what is Easter? Like, rebirth? Like, I don't understand. I know, I know I sound completely stupid right now because it's just not clicking in my head right now. I want to say it's like rebirth. Like, you know, just like... You know, but I'm kind of confused at this point. I don't know. Anyways, anyways, you guys, anyways, I'm going to stop having blonde moments. I'm going to go get dressed nicely because people seem like, and you know what? They can't even have church today. That's why it's on the fucking news. Duh. Hello. Okay. It's clicking now. The coffee's kicking in. I got it. I got it. I got it. Anyways, I think I'm going to go dress very formal today, which I don't think I ever do, to be honest with you. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to look really, really nice today. Uh, I'm going to be safe, hopefully, and go to Walmart real fast and just... Write down the stuff so I know what I'm there for because I, I never make a list. But since I'm getting like people's Easter baskets, I think I need to make a list so I'm not overdoing it. Because I normally overdo it with a bunch of shit that nobody wants. And and then like I'm like, I'm waiting for them to get their shit. I'm like, even Christmas, like I overdo it with shit that they just <laughs> don't want. When I could have just got like specific things that they did want and like spend less money. So I'm like sitting there waiting, 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 like 
oh, I'm so happy. Like they're gonna like be a, you know, and then they're like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> I am so bad at gifts. I am horribly at gifts. <clears throat> I'm very, very bad at gifts. But anyways, you guys, so sorry for wasting your time, but I don't think I'm wasting your time because you're on my channel. So I guess I could look stupid if I want to. I don't know. Anyways, I hope you guys have a beautiful Easter and I'll talk to you guys later. Um, comment down below. Tell me what you guys are doing today. Tell me what uh, you've been doing this whole quarantine thing. I think I'm going a little cuckoo. I've been by myself for like a very, very long time. So I'm like, when I got the chance for everyone to go to my grandma's house and just spend Easter together, I was like, there is nothing that could stop me. I was going to work until seven and then go. And I'm like, no, no. I'm just not going to go to work today. And then I'm going to go spend time with my family because I've been alone for too damn long. I've literally been in this house by myself for a whole month. <sighs> now, I think that's enough damn time to see if I had the corona. I mean, Jesus Christ. You know, this is just stupid. This whole thing is stupid. I go on the... I know I told you guys bye, but one, one moment, okay? I... I go on my phone and it's just getting like very annoying. I can't even get on my phone without seeing the death death toll in uh, United States and in California. So mark me if I'm wrong, but on my phone there was an email saying the coronavirus in the U in the U.S. killed twenty thousand people already. My question that I want to know, if anybody knows this question, what are they doing with the bodies? And after you're dead, does the body still carry the virus since your body's not living anymore? You know, like, for instance, right, there's sick people out there in the world. Say you're buried, or maybe they burn you, but what if you don't, what if you don't want to get burned? Because I know, I'm sorry, but I know I don't want to get burned. Like, I want to get buried. I want, like, the old-fashioned, you go visit the grave site and put flowers and shit. That's what I want. Because, like, for instance, I have my sister sitting here in my living room, and she's just sitting there, you know? And it's like, I know she's there, but it's, it's more memorable if you... Take the time out to go to the graveside and, you know, show your appreciation and stuff. <sighs> but, anyways, um, yeah, it's just, what are they doing with all the bodies? Where are they putting all the bodies if there's so many bodies? <laughs> and after this whole COVID thing, are people going to have funerals for their loved ones with the body actually there? I don't know. I mean, this whole thing is just really trying to eliminate the population and see who's strong enough to stick around and take out the weak. That's really what it do. That that's what it's doing. And I'm not talking about weak as just like a human being, but I'm talking about like your body. That's just how I, because I heard something like it's in the Bible somewhere where there's gonna be um, a sickness that goes around and it's gonna kill millions of people, and you know. He's going to take the ones that he needs up there and keep the ones that are needed down here. I don't know. But, whatever. I'm done wasting your guys' time. I'm going to go make my list so I can get it going here because I'm in my jam still. So, I love you guys. I hope you guys have a really, really good Easter. And comment down below what you guys are doing today. And, mwah, bye guys.